Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Derek. You can call me Panzo6. And before we get this video started, and I promise this won't be very long, but I just want to go ahead and say that this is not, not aimed towards anybody in particular. I know there's really good people in this world. I know plenty of them. And, you know, there's there's a this world has a lot of hope. There's a, people have hope. But as of late... Uh, especially this weekend, we've seen a lot of crazy things happening. Um, just, and it's affected all of us, whether we like it or not. It has affected all of us. Um, so, with that said, because um, I really don't want to make you guys think I'm singling people out, because I'm not. This is not a hate video. This is basically an open assertion um, and what I think is going on. So, this past weekend, especially last night and Saturday, uh, we've had two shootings. Um, the first one involved a YouTuber slash, uh, I think she was a former voice singer that was murdered at a meet and greet. And almost well over 50 some, I think about 50 plus casualties, maybe 50 and more 50 some injured uh, during a mass shooting. but targeted out the LGBT community. Now, these past two days, this is this has happened twice. You know, one was a small shooting, but still it's a life. Then we have 50 lives, plus the other 50 or so that's injured. Um, and it's really sick. It's really sick. We now have, you know, as the United States, um, one of the biggest mass shootings in history, in history now, we now have that. And I'm not saying banned guns or anything like that. This is not that kind of video. Um, but what, what have we become? What has society become? You know, we take a look every single day on the news, uh, the mainstream media, and it's littered with violence, hate, discrimination, um... We have people that's trying to run this country and people that are running this country that don't care about us. They don't care about humanity. They care about themselves and the price of what's in their wallet. That mythical thing called money. Um, and, you know, a lot of people don't see that. They don't see that. Um, and it's true. It's true. We got liars, cheaters. Um, and the worst kind of people running this country. And, you know, we also have the fear. We can't love people. We can't love anybody without worrying about being hated and now being murdered. We're too, we're too worried about what other people's actions are. You know, you can't go out the street if you're a gay man. The color of your skin... <laughs> If you're a man or a woman, your religion, all that stuff gets hated on. And it's terrible. It's terrible. You can't believe what you want to believe in. You can't be a Christian. You can't be an atheist. You can't be a Muslim. And the list goes on. You can't be any of that because people automatically go to hate you for this. You'll get torn up. We live in a time where a guy can basically go out and rape a young woman in an alley by a dumpster and basically get a pat on the back and get out scot-free. Yes, he has some charges. He is now a sex offender. But the crime, the punishment doesn't fit the crime. You know, all these people that got murdered this weekend, those targeted, they were gay, lesbian, gay, transgender, bisexual. Why? Why are we doing this to ourselves? We take a look at this universe, and we're just small. We are really, really small. And we're just killing each other. We're hating each other. We don't care about each other. You know? <laughs> we hate what people what people have. If somebody has more, we hate them. We want to destroy them. If somebody is poor, we hate them because we think they're disgusting. If you're middle class, everybody's getting fucked. We're all getting fucked. One way or the other. We have people that's, you know, starving. 
And all we care about is the fucking Kardashians. We got to keep up with them. Mainstream media doesn't cover that shit. We don't cover, you know, all the other bad things. We just care about what Hillary Clinton, uh, Donald Trump, Kim Kardashian. That's all we care about on mainstream media. We get that shoved down our throats every fucking day. And when something bad happens in this country, you know, immediately, immediately we go to blame somebody else. You know, a lot of people think, you know, we take out, take away the guns, that's going to help. That may help a little bit. I think there should be laws that prevent some psychopath from grabbing a gun. There should be checks and balances for people that should not be able to get a weapon. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't have to worry about going somewhere without being, you know, hated upon, looked down, judged. We should have these problems, but we do every fucking day, every day. And all these people have lost their lives over nothing. Cause some asshole decides to go out and decides to target these people and fucking murder them with no disregard of family Friends, nothing. We don't care. They, he didn't care about the feelings of these people. He didn't. The young girl that got murdered did not fucking care about her, her family, her friends, all the people that changed that her life helped change people. The things she done helped change people. That doesn't fucking matter. People act uh people do this thing. We we like I said, we hate each other. We don't love each other. We don't trust each other. We are afraid of each other. And we shouldn't be. It's 2016. We still have sexism, racism, religious wars. We're too worried about stamping out gay people. We're, we're too worried about that. And marijuana. Been looking at the biggest problems we have. Taking care of each other. We have media that's based on filth. I just don't understand it. And like I said, I'm not generalizing this towards everybody. Because there's awesome people in this world. There's great people. There's Great, great people here. But we don't get to see that. The media doesn't cover that. We don't. We never see that. And the rare cases we do, it's very, very small. Very, very small that we see that. And it's really sad. I just don't fucking understand. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's, I woke up to this. This is the second day that I woke up to some news that somebody, somebody or a lot of people getting murdered for nothing. For nothing. I don't understand it. I just don't understand. I really don't understand why this is happening. Why people have to worry about this. And if, if you think this is going to, like, this news is going to go away. No, this is going to be on there for a long time. This is history. This is terrible. This is terrible. Just terrible. And I know I'm not the best person to talk about this because, you know, I stutter and you know, all this stuff. And you know what? I'll probably get a lot of hate for it. I really don't care. I really don't care because, you know, I'm not generalizing this to you, but if you want to come in and hate on it, then maybe you're the fucking problem. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter what you believe in. It doesn't matter what color your skin is. It doesn't matter who you love. It doesn't matter what shape you are, or what kind of money you have, it shouldn't matter. We all are on this planet together. We all have the same thing. We have skin and blood and bones, and we all have our own experiences. 
That's what separates each other. We're all different, but we're all the same. We share this small planet. You know, and you know, as I used to be an atheist, I used to be an atheist, and there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with being an atheist, and I will never, never, ever tell somebody they're wrong for being an atheist. I will never tell somebody they're wrong for believing in what they want to believe in, or love what they want to love. Now, as a Christian. I want to pray to these people. I want to pray for all these people. Because, you know, they need help. The people that has these problems that go out to commit these acts, they need help. They shouldn't be in a position to have a weapon. They shouldn't. I know it's a right to bear arms in this country. I had a gun myself. My brother has guns. My family has guns. There should be a right to bear arms, but there shouldn't be a right for some psychopath or somebody that suffers from serious problems, a mental state, has a terrible background that, you know, people, know, they knowingly know this person has problems with other people. They shouldn't have that. They should not be able to get a gun. Probably wouldn't have stopped them anyways. They probably would have still got a weapon because guns are easy to get. Ammo, ammo is easy to get. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry that I kind of came out the gate just screaming because I, I didn't mean it to be that way. But we we need to <laughs> we need to ask ourselves this question: Why have we become in this huge society, as humanity, what have we become? Take a look at the news today and even go back as far as you can. Take a look at all the crazy things that's happened in this world. Rather be terrorist attacks, mass shootings, you know, you name it. Look at all the hate. But try to also look at all the good things that's happened in this world. Look at all the good people. Take your time out of your day. Say hello to somebody. Smile. Help a person out. Just do that. Because at the end of the day, the best thing we could do for one of each other, one, <laughs> see I am stuttering all over the place, um, the best thing we could do for each other is love one another. Show compassion. Stop the judgment. That's what we need to do. It may not ever come to fruition, but it's worth trying, at least. Again, I'd like to go ahead and say this, and I want to stress this. I can't stress this enough. There's plenty of good people in this world. There's People do great things in this world. But our problem is the mainstream media and how and we don't cover the good things. We, we only care about the bad things. They care about the bad things. They care about what gets them the most clicks during the day to get the extra money. We don't care about that. And, you know, me making this video might seem a little hypocritical. But I've been making videos almost every day this week. And this is something that kind of escalated and I wanted to talk about it because that's the big thing that you know that should be talked about. Again, guys, my name is Derek. You can call me Panzo6. If you like this video, be sure to hit like and subscribe. Again, I love you guys. You know, definitely say a prayer. You know, if you believe it, if you don't believe it, that's fine. I will never tell you, you know. You're wrong either way. But either way, I'll pray for you. I'll pray for everyone. Um, and like I said, just just be nice to one another. Love each other. Take care of each other. Help each other out. Just do what you can to make this world better. Um, 
as I, you know, I'd hate to see another one of these things happening. I, I hate to see it because, you know, in, in the United States, we've had so many mass shootings, um, whether it be school shootings or you name it. Um, I just don't want this country to be torn apart. I don't want the world to fall apart. And I just want good things for everybody. <laughs> so that's all I have to say. And again, be sure to hit like and subscribe if you like this. And if you have anything you want to say about it, you know, I'm not going to tell you you're wrong. Just don't go in and come in here hating on it um, and just trying to cause problems because that's not what this is for. Like I said, we have good people in this world and let's just kind of keep it that way. Again, my name is Manso6. Like, subscribe, share, whatever. I love you guys and I'll be praying.